Get ready for some nice, relaxing farming! Hello, subscribers and future subscribers. I'm Karma Jolt. This game is Stardew Valley. And I am about to continue from where I left off, which was like sometime in the middle of spring. It was like spring the 15th to something like that. No. It might have been like spring 10th. I don't even remember. I, I get confused on the date IRL, so I don't know why I'm trying to guess the fake date. Like I'm gonna be any better at that. Looking for saved games. Yes, this is me, Throat Punch, day nine of spring, year one, on Awful Memes Farm. I've been farming for a whole two hours and ten minutes, uh, you know, of IRL time. And the first thing I'm gonna do when I wake up is water my bed, because that's what I always do. Damn, look at how much fucking money I just got. Um, oh, I can fix that rat problem, can I? I can investigate the community center. What's up, bed? All right, keep you nice and moist. I always do that. I always pick up the TV, like, first thing. Hey, welcome to KOZU5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now, the weather forecast for tomorrow. Partially cloudy with a light breeze. Expect lots of pollen. Okay, cool. Um, I could also get my fortune today. But you know what? I'm just gonna go out and do the thing that I love most. Watering things. I'm gonna get straight to work on my farm. Oh shit! I can already harvest some parsnips. Say that zero times fast. Look at me making all these things wet right here. It's called watering plants. I don't know if you've ever had a farm, but that's what you're supposed to do. You use water to make things grow. Humans require water too, fun fact. Uh, in fact, our bodies are made of like, like 69% of water from what I understand. What happens if I run out of water and I try to water something? What? Out of water? Should be like, mm -hmm. Should be like, I'm not sweating? That's the, what the little comic bubble above her said. Um. Yeah, make sure to water behind the ears and behind the scarecrow. You know what I'm gonna do right now? I'm gonna cut this tree down. I'm gonna cut this tree down because I don't like the way it's obstructing my view of the crops. And I kinda want them to get a little more sunlight, so... Timber, motherfuckers! Bop, 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 bop. I got so much sap and pine cones and wood right there. Uh, all of which, presumably, is useful. Was there anything here? I can't really see. But just to make sure, I will water that spot as well. And you know what else I could do today that I haven't really messed with at all? I haven't really tried to make friends in this town yet, which, you know, my mother would, like, be concerned about, you know? She's like, oh, how are, are you making friends in your new town? What? You aren't? What the fuck is wrong with you, child? You're like 25. Go meet women at a bar or something. Um, also, just for the hell of it, I'm gonna take a look at what I can craft. Because I know, oh, basic fertilizer. Ingredient sap, improve, oh, improve soil quality a little. Increasing your chance to grow quality crops. Mix into tilled soil. I'm gonna make one of these because why not right now? It just requires sap, I'm gonna make two of them. And then next time I'm planting some crops, I'm going to uh, put some fertilizer down first. Also, this pine cone can be used to make trees, which I guess is a good thing. I mean, because I'll constantly be needing a whole bunch of wood. Yeah, why don't I give back to the forest that has given me so much already? Boom. I'm going to put this pine cone right here and water it. Alright, don't let me forget that guy. I actually don't know if I have to water him at all. It kind of looks like I don't because the soil didn't change any color when I dropped the water on it. Um, so maybe I can just set it and forget it and that's cool. Hey, why don't I go to the shop and spend all my money? <clears throat> that's what I just came back from doing IRL. I got gross. I spent so much money on cream cheese. Not really. I spent just enough that we can make a cheesecake. And that is what Ludacrunch and I are going to do later. Well, mostly her, because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Oh, shit! I just pickaxe this fucking door. What you got for me, Pierre? Uh, well, you know how much I love parsnips. 
They only take four days to mature. I can't believe I just pronounced it that way. That's so stupid. I'm, I apologize. Uh, have I made any cauliflower? I think I have. Kale seeds. Give me a break. All right, you know what? Against my better judgment, I'm going to get some kale seeds and a whole bunch of parsnips. Boom! Good thing I freed up some inventory space. Let's go with farming. But also, like, like I said I'd do, I might check out the community center. Which is somewhere around the town, if I remember correctly. It's like somewhere in this town. Who's this right here? Jody? Have I met Jody yet? Exercise is important for staying healthy. I always make sure to set aside some time for it. That's honorable. Jody, that really is honorable, because a lot of us just, you know, we're like, oh, I'll exercise someday, and then we never do. And then we're like, oh, let's make a cheesecake instead. Yeah, that's, that's an appropriate replacement for exercise. It's not even 11 a.m. yet. I'm about to make some fucking crops. Um, and so I'm going to fertilize some fucking soil here. And I'm going to plant kale seeds on the fertilized soil. Then I'm going to water them. Is this something that I didn't water yet? It's like actually really hard to see behind these trees sometimes. I'm making excuses for like why I fucked up, you know. Uh, and I know I could be organizing these crops a little better, okay, but I just... Who cares? You know, it's my farm! You don't get to tell me what to do. Oops, pardon me for a second. Why don't I just put fertilizer in the water, and then everything that I water from now on will get fertilized? I'm a genius! No, it probably doesn't work that way. Hey, what you got for me, box? I'm gonna put my wood in here. Oh, I just, I don't even have to uh, drag it. I just click it and it works. Okay, I'll click the okay button. And you know what I'm gonna do? Before I go into town and make friends, I'm gonna search for some wild ass uh, green onions or whatever they are. You know what I'm talking about. What is this guy? Man, there's so many things in the ground that I just don't know what they are. Like this thing? What the fuck kind of plant is this flying one? All right, and just for the heckin' cool of it, I'm going to uh, try to fish. I got some green algae. Green Al Yankovic. What the hell am I talking about? By the way, if I sound extra dumb today, it's because I am. Hey, there we go. I found a leak, which is what the the opposite of what our current White House administration wants me to find. Hey, more politics and shit. Uh, hey, this is the path I was looking for. You know what, maybe I should make paths throughout my property so I, like, don't get lost on my own fucking farm. Because that's, like, sort of happened a few times already. Uh, and I can get cows over here. And I know there's, like, some... Oh, the birds! I scared them. I should have caught one with a Pokeball. Who is this? Who is this handsome young lady? Hello, neighbor. You know what? I'm gonna give you a leak. No? How do I do? This is a really nice gift. Thank you. I'm really good at giving gifts. You're welcome, Leah. I hope we can be friends now. We both live outside of town. Does that mean something? Yeah, uh, it means we gotta walk if we want to get to the community center. We should build roads and a public transportation system. You're a genius, Leah. Nobody's thought of that yet? We should do it. And not just, I'm not just saying that like, oh yeah, we should totally do that. And then we never actually do that. I'm not like one of those guys who's like, always thinking of ideas but never doing them. Because first of all, I'm not a guy. I am a beautiful lady named Throat Punch. And I'm stealing your spring onions. Damn, those just grow out in the wild. I can't say how many times I've gone out into the forest or the wilderness or anywhere in public and just eaten whatever was growing out of the ground. I don't think I've ever done that IRL. But, you know, I, 
Also, I also don't want to ruin any impression of me that you might have, so I apologize if that spoiled the surprise. BAM! Oops, I chopped the wrong wood. Okay, I guess I'm gonna sell these spring onions. Do they have winter and summer and fall onions? I imagine so. It's like the treasures in Kirby. It's one for each season. Um, what the fuck should I do today? I can make like little wooden paths around my house. Is that tedious or useful? So wait, yeah, let's see what I can craft again. So wooden fence keeps grass and animals contained. I don't know if I need that. Cobblestone path. Place on the ground to create a path or to spruce up your floors. It says floors. I expected it to say home. A campfire? I can build a campfire. I don't know if I need that. A gate takes a whole bunch of wood. What is this? Gravel path? That takes stone. Well, what's the difference here? Spruce up your floors? Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's make some cobblestone paths right here. I'm gonna just plant one. There we go. I got a path leading from my steps to exactly here. I am just basically, uh, Tim Allen. You think you know everything about home improvement, don't you? Did I sell the, um, the onions? The spring onions? Okay, cool. Well, shit, it's five o'clock already? Time for a drink. Oh, I only have 500 bucks, though. I don't know if I can buy a beer with that. Nah, let's do it. Let's go to the old saloon. Wait, first I wanted to find the community center. I did mean to do that. Is there like a... Oh, there's no, like, signage here that tells me where shit is. Oh, you know what I totally forgot? I forgot about birthdays. I forgot about Maylee's birthday. Oh, that t probably says Haley. I don't really know who these people are. I know Lewis, and I definitely mentioned, like, Oh, somebody remind me about Lewis's birthday, and I fucked that up. So it might be Shane's birthday. Well, when's Leah's birthday? Because she's my only real friend. I can't turn the page here. That's fine. Well, let's go find that community center. Star Drop Saloon. What's your name? Oh, I know Alex. The beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. Yeah, tubular dog. That's pretty gnarly. Penny. I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. By the way, Jazz is just some little girl. Probably uh, her real name is Jasmine. It is not the guy from um, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Uh, wait, so if I use this map here, it shows where I am. Here's a graveyard. Saloon. I'm trying to look for the community center. There's Awful Memes Farm. Man, there's a lot of stuff on this map. Okay, it's way north of me. That's where I'm going. Okay, let's go in and try to figure out this rat situation. Shall we? Because they're definitely not fucking rats if they can teleport. Can rats teleport? I've never had a rodent problem that bad. And I, like, wrote for a pest control blog for a really long time. So, we figured I'd, like, know about this shit. No? Okay. I thought maybe. I thought maybe. Oh, shit, I could pick up a little daffodil. That's cute. There's a playground? Can I use the slide? Oh, I can't... can't oh, I can cast my, my line there. I'm just gonna water this slide real quick. Make it a little more slidey. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna go to my left here. Damn, that's already seven. I'm spending way too much time doing nothing. Okay, wait, how do I get to where the community center is? Because it looks like... It looks like it's straight north, but am I blocked off here? I'm gonna go in after dark and it's gonna be super scary right now. How do I get up on this cliff? Ugh, this game's so hard and confusing. Oh, is this it? 
This is it. Never mind. I'm in. I am a dumb. <gasps> Did someone leave a note? No. Ah! I watered the note! And there's some literature. Can I, like, um. Do you hear these creepy sounds? I couldn't read that note, by the way. It wasn't, wasn't gonna let me do any of that. What's this? <gasps> What's this? Is this a coded message? Oh gosh, do I have to like turn it upside down and look at it in the mirror? Or do I eventually learn some language? I'll try to decipher this later, or not at all. There's some wood. What is that scary coded message about? It's a little creepy in here. Um, and so far, no sign of those rats. So, I must be doing my job. Must be doing a great job getting rid of them. I can't really interact with anything in here. Tell me if you see anything suspicious, okay? Because right now it doesn't look like there are any... Well, that there's anything in here. Yo, there's an old-ass bulletin board? <clears throat> I want to know what the bulletins were. What is this guy? A busted up safe? Wind chimes are always creepy, by the way. I don't know why people like them shits. It's just always creepy and scary. Those and church bells? Oh my gosh. Like, if there were church bells in an underwater level in any video game, that would be the ultimate scary. Well... I'm gonna water this, uh, you know, vegetation. Can't harvest any of it. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. So maybe... Like, really, the only thing to interact with is this... Book is this coded message that I don't understand. Is it supposed to be obvious here? Like, this looks like a 9. That looks like a G. Maybe an AU. I don't know. I'll figure that out later, I guess. Like I said, I would. Well, let's get out of here. Whoa, it's like 10.30. Where the fuck am I? I need to go all the way to the west. It is super dark right now. How am I not tripping over shit? Uh, someone help guide me back to my home. Oh, good. There are street lamps. Man, it's dark as fuck in here. I hope I don't get mugged. I'm gonna equip my pickaxe just in case. What was that? Probably nothing. I just got spooked for no reason. Well. Ah! It opened on its own? That's haunted and creepy. I'm gonna go to bed. Holy shit, it's scary in here. 11 11, make a wish. Go to sleep for the night? Yeah, you bet I will. Well, I made some money. <clears throat> I made $163 from uh, Wild... No, from Parsnips that I that I built on my own. I didn't build them, I grew them. That's the word I'm thinking of. Daffodil is 30 bucks. Spring onions aren't too much money, but I mean, hey, they're free. It's free money. My progress has been saved. Today is day 10, spring year one. Thanks for being so good to me, bed. Here's your... Daily drink of water. The Queen of Sauce! It's a rerun. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe for my secret cookbook. This week's dish, I've probably already seen this one. Stir-fry, it's a perfect way to get some healthy greens in your on your plate. Saute the greens in a little sesame seed oil. Sesame oil, that is. Yeah, I've definitely seen that one. Sesame oil, ginger, garlic. Now breathe deeply, oh that's good. You already know how to curse, cook, stir fry. Curse, stuck fry is what I was about to say. Whoa, there's a cat. Oh, and a person. Holy shit. Who is this? Marnie? Hello, throat punch. You see this cat here? Yeah, I do. Yes, I see that cat. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor little thing. Do I get a kit right now? I think it likes this place. Hey, um. Don't you think this farm could use a good cat? Yes! Yes, help me catch all the, the mice and the rats. Choose a name. Oh, Miso's cute, but... What should I name this cat? Hey, Tosh. Yeah. What should I name this cat? Beep. Beep? 
Oh wait, it gives me a whole bunch of random options. Like, Brenana? What about waffles? No, I'm naming it Noodle. I'm naming the cat Noodle. She loves it. She loves that idea. Yes! I named it Noodle! Well, little Noodle, you be a good kitty now, okay? Don't tell my Noodle what to do! Oh shit, and I got a letter too. I hope it's Leah being like, hey, um, thanks for the, you know, uh, parsnip or wild something that you gave me. Uh, it definitely didn't give me food poisoning. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake. In the stone tower, I may have information concerning your rat problem. What the hell name is this? M. Rasmodius Wizard? Sounds like a cool dude. So, yeah, I guess I'll go check him out. Hey, I'm watering my plants. What the fuck? Didn't I just cut down a whole bunch of trees around here? <sighs> okay, I guess I'm cutting some more trees down. And I'm picking some parsnips. Uh, I don't quite know when my, you know, any other of my vegetables will be ready, but the parsnips... Parsnips are probably not the most efficient way to spend my money, I gotta say. They're probably not. But, I don't know, I like him, okay? <clears throat> did I water this guy? Yeah, I totally did. Like, they probably, there's, you know, I probably get a better return on investment from, from other vegetables. I'm just guessing that. Damn, when do I get a watering can that can water, like, two squares at once? I bet I can do that pretty soon, come to think of it. I should cut down, like, all of these trees that are encroaching on my farmland right now. Because, like I keep complaining about, they make it hard for me to see where where I've watered. Requires scythe. This guy requires scythe? Oh, shit, I got kale! Wait, that popped up super fast. Oh no, that must have been one that I planted a while back. That wasn't the one that I just planted. Well, hell yeah, I just scythed me some kale. I just harvested the fuck out of that kale. Um, Kale, motherfucking yeah yeah. All right, let me cut down this tree. I hope if it, I hope it doesn't like kill the plants that it lands on if I chop it down. Bop. Oh, that could have been bad. Didn't look like it killed anything. I'm gonna cut down this tree too, because it's making me angry. What do I got here? An acorn? Oh, that, ah! <laughs> that can be used to plant a different type of tree, I assume. And this guy too, just because I feel like going on a, a tree chopping spree. And I got a lot of wood from that. All right, I'm gonna put shit in my box. And then sell this kale and this parsnip. Yo, that letter told me to go somewhere like to the west of the lake. You know what, I should have kept one of those to eat for stamina. Now that I think about it, I probably should have kept one of those to eat. But maybe I can find like a wild, you know, onion thing. So wait, what did that, um, meet the wizard. You received a letter from the local wizard. You know, just a local wizard. You know how every town has a wizard. He claims to have information regarding the old community center. Entered the wizard's tower? Am I finally gonna have to, like, combat shit, by the way? I'm guessing no. Something tells me no. But yeah, where's that tower? Also, make sure to bring pl plenty of water with you. Because, you know, you never know when you're going to get thirsty. Actually, sometimes you fucking know. Like, most of the time you know. Like, you could just kind of count on yourself to get thirsty because humans require water. I don't know if you knew that about humans or anything. Beep, boop, bop. Alright, so is the wizard's tower located on my map? Yes, it fucking is. Let's go to the weast. I should... Maybe I should do that tomorrow. I don't know if I have the stamina for that right now. I'm gonna get water here, though. 
Uh, is there anything for me to eat? I wonder if I just like catch a fish, can I just fucking eat it like immediately? That wasn't Max, give me a break. Well, let's catch a fish and eat it. Just show it who's boss. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. I got some algae. All right, I'm gonna eat it actually. Uh, how do I eat it? Yes, I will eat it. <laughs> I had to jump up and catch it in my mouth to eat it. What the fuck is that thing? That looks like a wizard's tower if you ask me. If you ask me. So how do I get up there? I bet I just go around. No, it couldn't be that easy. What is this box? Da -na 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 -na. What was that? Hmm. This might not be the wizard's tower now that I think about it. Oh, never mind. Ah, come in. That wizard has a cowboy hat. I don't trust. I think this is not the kind of wizard. I am Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths, destroyer of rats. I got a pest control service. Mediator between physical and ethereal. Master of the seven elementals. You, okay, you have such a big text box. You can't put at least two sentences on the same text box right here. You call yourself a wizard. Not a grammar wizard. Keeper of the sacred cha, you get the point. Yes, you fancy yourself a sorcerer. And you, throat punch, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. Or at least since I sent you that letter. Here, I'd like to show you something. What is it, though? Behold! My dope-ass cape. Oh, he actually summoned, like, an apple or something. What is that? Don't hurt it! You've seen one before, haven't you? I guess. What is that? Oh, it looks like it's in trouble. They call themselves... The Junimos? Kind of reminds me of the Jujus from, uh... Banjo-Kazooie. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Probably because you caught them in a fucking bubble. I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Probably because it's an abandoned building and they don't have to pay rent there. Uh, yeah, you're like abusing these little animals. Hmm, you found a golden scroll written in an unknown language? Uh, that's, yes, that's precisely what I found. Most interesting. Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. You just want me to, like, hang around your house? Oh, you can teleport. Okay, so that won't take too long, I guess. Might as well explore this guy's house. Oh, shit. And then he uses the front door to come back. I found the note. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. It's Spanish. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. Ah. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Uh, guess I am not quite one. Hmm, one with the forest. What do they mean? Oh, I have to become a tree. Like that thing in Fallout 3, remember? Sniff, sniff. This note smells suspiciously like paper. Aha! Uh, come here. I don't know if I trust or like this guy. He's got a stupid hat and a stupid beard. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss grub, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? Yeah, in fact, it's toxic to humans. Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. Oh, gosh. Can we quit talking about things permeating my body right now? Oh, by the way, it's like, you know, 40% alcohol by volume. So, hope you had some carbs for lunch. I had algae. Ooh, I'm starting to see some dope-ass colors. I am so one with the forest right now. I am one as fuck with the woods and the trees. Damn, look at all these leaves and the roots and the nuts. Uh, 
does this like skip the fucking thing? This is a neat little cutscene that I thought I could interact with for a second, but I guess not. You've gained the power of forest magic. You can now decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. Wow, that's a pretty good magic trick, I suppose. But I'd rather be able to, like, shoot fire. Not like at the forest, you know, you trees don't have anything to worry about. I wasn't gonna burn down the forest, I just think fire's cool, okay? Yeah, the forest probably disagrees with me on that one. Honestly, though, if I could pick any element for my magical spells, like if I could have magic IRL, I would choose ice. Because I honestly think that's what Samuel L. Jackson would do. It's Leah. Oh my gosh. I didn't mean to, like, run into her. This morning I accidentally stepped on a bug. Oh. Did you give it a proper burial? I wonder if I can give her anything to cheer her up. I like her. I like Leah. I mean, I like Elliot, too, but something about Leah. Mm. Spring onion. I wonder if this spring onion will cheer up Leah. Or if she's allergic. I don't know. But I'm going to bring her a gift. Hey, Leah. Uh, I thought you might like this. This is a really nice gift. Thank you. She loves my gifts. She just loves me. All right, well, you know, see you around. Or, you know, whatever. Maybe sometime, you know, maybe we can hang out sometime. If, you know, you're not busy or anything. You know, we don't have to. No pressure. Did I seem too desperate there? Oh, my gosh. I hope I made, good, I hope I made a good impression on Leah. Well, it's 3.20 p.m. That's as good a time as any to, um, go to, go to bed, I guess. Not really. Did I not water this guy? All right, it just kind of looks like I didn't, but I totally did. What can I put in here? Some fiber, some stone, and some wood. Man, I got a lot of each of these things. What is this up here? Oh, I can change the color of my fucking box. I'm gonna make it pink, cause pink rules. Can I change the color of other shit in my house? You don't have any mail. Oh, I can take shit out of my um, my sales box if I really want. Weird that it didn't cost me like any paint or something to make that box or to change the color of that box. Well, let's go grab me a beer. I should be doing something with this money here. Like I have a lot of funds that I'm just doing nothing with right now that I could be turning into more money. But instead, I'm going to be turning them into uh, a drunken stupor, and I'm going to water the door. What you got for me, dog? I'm trying to purchase things. How do I purchase things? Oh, I just order a beer from here. Oh, I put it in my inventory? Okay. 50 energy and 20 health. Drink in moderation. I'm going to save up enough money to buy like 100 beers and see what happens. Also, there's another arcade game for me to water. I mean, play. There's a skull-shaped keyhole. I don't know what that's about, but I'm gonna play Journey of the Prairie King again and see what I can do. Pew, pew, pew. Haha! -ha! This game's fun. What are these little things? They sort of remind me of Octorox. I'm gonna pick up this coin. What do the coins do exactly? I'm not sure. Can I buy items with them? The items in this in this game actually kick ass. They give you like, oh, you know, invincibility and like a, a, a screen a full screen nuke. I can shoot diagonally. What the hell was I doing before? That makes the game a lot easier. What does the star do? <laughs> I think I made that joke last time too. I'm pretty sure it like spreads out my bullets though, which I will wait to use because right now. This level is chump change. Oh yeah, okay, it gives me like a shotgun thing. A shotgun spread effect. Hell yeah, this is exactly like Smash TV, except with, uh, you know, smaller prizes, smaller money, I love it. Total carnage. Well, I'm dominating this round. Last time I fucked up. I like died a million times last time I played this game. The coffee, I want it. That's like clearly the most important item. 
Yeah, and it makes you move faster. I'm gonna be playing this game like pretty much every time I record from now on. What the hell is that? I got struck by lightning. Holy shit, what is going on right now? Am I in like rage mode? It looked like the enemies were running away from me for a second. I probably just wasted whatever power up that was, but you know, you live and you learn. That guy takes multiple hits? What is this? Oh shit, yeah, hell yeah, I got rapid fire. Am I like not completely accurate here? Oh, never mind. It looked like there was like a bit of a uh, variance on like where the, on the precision of this weapon. What is that thing? Oh shit, I got eight. I died. That's seven coins. Oh, I kept my item. I didn't realize that after I died, I'd keep my item. Damn, I hate being slow right now. Oh shit, an extra life. I'm so good at this game. Is there a prize for doing well? I'm not even sure. Because I'm dominating and I should have a prize already. Crap, I really should have kept some sort of power up. The coffee, I need it. I need the coffee for sure. Just like every day. Haha, <laughs> coffee jokes. Don't talk to me until I've had my morning coffee. Oh shit. What's a little thing on the bottom? Is that a Maxim tomato? Come back! How did I miss him? Because I am a just a benevolent individual, and I was like, hey, you can keep your life and live. Alright, I'm sorta of done playing this. I'm gonna scoop. <laughs> I think I'm gonna scoop here. I'll use my coffee first to make it go faster. Did that cost me any money? I'm not even sure. Damn, negative one lives. I will quit this game. I'm sure I've got the high score. All right, let's get out of here. Hey, I'm gonna water this person. Nope. Sigh, hey kid, you're too young to be moping around in a place like this. No, I'm not. I'm 45. Who's this? Sup, Sam? Did you watch the game last night? Or wait, do you even have a TV set? Are there other TV programs that I can watch? Oh, I wanted to water that lady. Caroline. Hi there, do you have everything you need for the farm? Probably not, but like, I also don't have money to pay for the things I need, so that cancels out, right? I've got a beer. Can I sell this beer? Can I like put this beer in my... Actually, like, what if I just put it in my chest and save it for later? That's okay, right? I can do that. Will it spoil or will it go bad? I'm wondering. I'm wondering if that'll be a waste of 400 gold. Ah, there's a kitty! No, I didn't want to water the cat. Aww! Hey, Noodle! Do I need to feed this cat? Like, let me... I was about to say, let me go into town and, like, get some cat food. But, uh... It's probably closed by now. It's 6.20. Anyway, I'm gonna go to bed. Go to sleep for the night? Yes. Hey, so I pretty much did nothing this episode, so that's a great place to, to end. That's a great place to just cut this part. So thank you so much for watching me mindlessly play Stardew Valley for another episode. Until next time, this is Karma Jolt signing off. Tell your friends I'm great. Actually, I'm gonna hit OK so it saves the game first. Day 10 of Spring Year 1. Progress has been saved. All right, see ya.